looking for the brightest and the best. So um, I thought we got it with our last intern who just accepted a job. So we're ready to get another one. We're excited. What about you, Eric? Just what Kevin said, we're looking for, uh, for people to come work for us and we're coming back to where we got our education and trying to give back in, in that capacity. And what are some of your favorite memories of the studio that you can talk about on camera? He added that, I'm glad he added that last portion. Well, this ain't my first rodeo, buddy. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Um, there was a lot of late night camaraderie, um, a lot of silliness that went on, but a lot of serious work as well. Uh, lifelong friends and, um, you know, I actually, roommate you know, i had roommates that were in the program as well so i mean just it, it, it's a bond that it, it's tough to break what about you kevin yeah i agree i mean our landscape architecture community is so small we're going to always know each other the rest of our lives so it's been that community keeps on giving we bounce work off of one another we team on projects so it just makes sense to be here and get back to do it now we're coming up on the 90th anniversary of the landscape architecture program here the 100th anniversary of the college itself where do you see landscape architecture as a discipline going in the next 100 years, the next 90 years? How have you seen it evolve, whether it's AI, whether it's other means? How have you seen it evolve? Where do you see it going? Well, I see it as a bridge between all the different disciplines. We learn a little bit about all the different disciplines, whether it's architecture, interior design, civil engineering, and we typically act as the bridge between those disciplines in, in our real life work. Uh, definitely with all of our climate issues we're having around the state and devastations I mean we're, we're involved with all these projects whether it's green building or if it's doing different types of living shorelines so it's it's the sky's the limit we're a part of those teams and like you said we're, we need to be involved with all the architects and engineers moving forward go Gators go Gators